Switzerland, Europe. We are a full-time traveling family, so if you've missed any of our previous videos, please do go back and watch them. But for now, we're going to talk about our day in Paris and Tell what them. we've been up to. So we went downstairs. We got some breakfast, and guess what happened then? So our letter and it said, "You are going to see the Eiffel Tower, hmm. and we're going." It said that you can have a local bakery. Number three. Whoa, what does it say today? Bonjour. Paris. Spot the Eiffel Tower. Grab a sweet treat from a... From a local bakery. Woo! read it? So we are actually staying in the Meininger Hotel in Paris. It's actually just on the outskirts and you have to take a metro line in, but it doesn't take long. The mining that we're staying in, um, you can pay for a breakfast. The breakfast is quite good, isn't it, mate? Yeah, it's good. Um, we really enjoyed a bite to eat, packed a bag up, okay. and then we headed on the metro line into the city centre. What was that place that we arrived, boys? Can you remember the first monument that we saw in Paris? A roundabout. Yeah, but yeah, it was a roundabout. It was a roundabout, but what was in the middle of the Not roundabout? just any ordinary roundabout. No, no, no. It was oh, the, the s Arc, Arc de Triomphe. Yeah. Arc de yeah, you don't need to go along there. Uh, it's definitely worth going to see. Very impressive. And it's nice to watch the cars go around because they drive crazy around there. Yeah, there's no lanes at all. There's lots of bibbing and everyone's hustling and bustling and it's really busy. <laughs> Champs-Élysées, which is a famous shopping street in Paris. What type of things did we see on the Champs-Élysées, boys? Um, so Go on, Luca. We saw Christmas stars, we saw and we even saw a um, Woody star. Yeah, we saw a Disney star down the Champs-Élysées. Oh, it was in the Disney star. It was in the Disney star. Who's your favourite person? Buzz Lightyear. Buzz Lightyear. Yeah. Buzz Lightyear. Yeah. We saw a big, big Buzz Lightyear in the window. So we headed slowly down the Champs Elysee and then we found ourselves down another street that was filled with lots of designer shops. We didn't actually go in them, but we enjoyed looking at them. We saw Louis Vuitton. What else did we Ch see? That Chanel. Lego shop. Chanel. That Lego shop. Yeah, that was Louis Vuitton, that one. Louis Vuitton. Um... Anyway, we saw loads of designer. <laughs> Ollie's been really excited to come and see the Eiffel Tower, aren't you, Ollie? Yep. Yeah. Tell 
boys. Nice. Good. It was really tall. It I was... felt like it was going to fall on me. Oh, <laughs> I want to show you some of that. Oh, we got these little mini Eiffel Towers. Ah. We got these. And where are they going to go? In on our backpacks. Yeah, this is go. France. And then it says Paris on the other end. It does, doesn't it? Where's mine? I'll get in you it in a minute. It's in the bag. So anyway, we ended up walking all the way around the Eiffel Tower. We had a really nice day. After we walked around the I Eiffel Tower. Whee! Yes. Uh, we got this from France. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> well done. Clever boy. Come on then, Ollie. You tell him a bit. So, after we walked around it, we tried to find the cafe and then we found one right near it so we could see it while we had our drink we, and cookie. We yeah, did, what did, did we, we have? What did we have to drink? What? Chocolate. <laughs> a hot you, chocolate. The boys had a really nice hot chocolate to warm up while we looked onto the view of the Eiffel Tower. Because it has been really cold today. It has been pretty cold today. Oh. And all of the boys had a warm cookie. Oh, look at a really nice bite to eat with a view of the Eiffel Tower which was lovely and then what did we do next we got the metro back where the boys Ooh. actually Ooh. oh look at look at you tell them about this bit okay so we drove a train technically tell because... them about the train you drove Parker who drove us who drove the train back Wait. you did didn't and you? me and me and you so Luca and Parker were the metro train drivers. No, because today. tell you why, we went in the front and there's like these remote control things and we actually drove. they normally have a guest kitchen so we went to a local store picked up some meals and some olive bread which was really nice wasn't it Mike yeah and then we went into the guest kitchen rustled that up and we all sat and had a lovely meal in the I'll tell you what we had for a meal go on then you tell them so me and Ollie had a lasagna yeah Parker had a pizza yeah and you two had daddy what did you have was it masaka daddy had masaka and you had well, spark ball noodles noodles we all had a little bit different teas tonight but it just worked out brilliant because we were all tired from a long day exploring paris oh uh, yeah and now... after this we're, we're watching ratatouille together but it's not a late night tonight we've got to get no. packed up we've got another busy travel day tomorrow we don't want to be late for our train because we are heading somewhere new so... <gasps> somewhere very Christmassy. paris has yeah. been is it a surprise yeah yeah Paris has been a massive hit. We've really enjoyed it. Haven't had long here, but it's just been enough time just to explore the typical touristy spots. If you're interested in following our journey, please hit the like button, please hit the subscribe button, and for more adventures with us, because you're not going to want to miss where we're going next. See you soon.